what is up guys and welcome back to the channel welcome back to way of the hunter today we got part four of our early access series today we're back in nez Perce valley and in this video we managed to take down our biggest buck in the game so far also in this video we take our first trip to transylvania the european map in way of the hunter and get our first glimpse of some of the amazing animal species on the map if you like the video don't forget to drop a like on it it helps the channel so much i appreciate it subscribe to the channel if you haven't already but without further ado let's jump into it Look at that. Isn't that wild? My graphics aren't even maxed out I, either. Like, I'm running like medium high settings. I can't even imagine like on a on an insane rig with the, with the graphics maxed out. Just absolutely stunning. Like the as good as the graphics are and the visuals. The sound might be my favorite part of this game. It's such a big part of the immersion. Like, I feel like any game nowadays can have good graphics. But to, to pair up the sound with it in a way that ups the immersion like that is really hard to do. And they nailed it. They absolutely nailed it. And they deserve all the credit for that. Like, listen to the water. It gets very much like in real life, you know? It's quieter. You don't have to get too far away for it to get quieter. But when you get right down into that valley that the water's in, all that sound is just radiating. Just like in real life, man. Now, we gotta find some red deer. Hey, hey. That might be our first red deer right there. Wait. That looks like sheep. Are those mouflon? Those are mouflon. Whoa. <laughs> awesome. I love the photo mode itself. I love that you can, like, do that and, like, you know... Go down there and look at the animals up close. Like, how cool is that? But I, the problem I see with it is that people will use it as like a huge advantage while hunting. I've already used it a couple times while hunting to see where animals are. It's kind of hard not to, but my gosh, look at that thing. Holy. <laughs> it's so much fun to do this though. Wow, the detail, the fur detail is on another level. 15. Trying to get one. Shoot our first wild boar. Might have been a little high. Oh. Could have shot it again, uh, but I'm not reloaded. Uh, he looks fine to me. He looks healthy. I don't see any blood behind him. Oh, and he's down. He's not healthy at all. In fact, he's dead. In fact, he's actually dead. We got a we got a pig. We're eating good tonight. We got venison. We got a little pork. Bacon wrapped venison burgers. Who's hungry? Okay, there he is. Our first wild boar. Oh, they look so good too. Oh my gosh. Wow. Just oh, nicked kind of just over that scapula. Oh, wow. Two shots? I didn't shoot it twice. Did I shoot this guy yesterday? Did I shoot a pig yesterday? I must have shot him yesterday. Ah, he survived a lung shot. Because I guess just because it barely touched the lung. Oh, okay. Yeah, it shows you kind of how well you hit. So we just barely touched that lung. Oh, that's so cool. That is so detailed. What's that? Is that a fox? It is. It's a roe deer. It's a roe deer! It's a first look at roe deer! Oh, there's a bunch of them! Wow, pretty big herd for roe deer. That's interesting. That's wild. Hi! As far as I can go. Tiny little buck. Oh, a bit of... Probably a one star, probably an older one star there. Look at that. Wow. <laughs> How good does that look? Jeez. I wouldn't mind shooting that guy if I get the opportunity. Wow. Two, two star mature, I think that's him right there. Um, 
243, I imagine we'll be fine for these, this, these guys. Let's zero in for 50. That'll do it. <laughs> wow. That's our first road here. Not a bad looking one. Two star mature, I believe it was. Not bad at all. Yeah, perfect shot. Look at that. Just what we wanted. Um, where does it show? Oh, genetics. 40.73. So really low genetics there. I gotta start remembering to look at that for all the kills. 40.7. Very low genetics. That guy wouldn't have gotten probably any bigger than that. Two star. Hey, look at the pig. Should we hit one? Road kill? Uh oh. Oh no. Is it gonna happen? Oh gosh. Oh no. I don't want to do it. I don't want to do it. I don't have it. I don't have it in me, man. It doesn't seem right. It just doesn't seem right. <laughs> uh, I don't know. Oh, I can't help myself. I see red. I'm seeing red. Uh, I have to hit one. I have to do it. Oh, gosh. Oh, no. Oh, I can't help it. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, what have I done? I feel terrible. Oh, gosh. Look at it. Oh. <laughs> Why would he... Why would he do that? Oh, gosh. Oh, broken leg for sure. Oh, I'm so sorry. We can't do that anymore. It's fun, but we can't do that anymore. Look at that guy. That might be a monster out there. Oh my gosh, okay, no, that's not, that's not the two-star, nope, that's, that's got double forks. Okay, I think that's the biggest melee we've seen. <laughs> that's actually, that looks like it's a huge deer. Yeah, double forks. No, that two-star mature had the top fork, and then it just had the single tine in the front. So that is definitely something bigger. Maybe a three or four-star, if I'm lucky. There's so many things I want to do. I want to try hunting wolves. I want to go up and hunt moose. I want to shoot some elk. It's a four-star mature. We have to shoot that. Oh, it's a four-star mature, and we do have to shoot it because it's mature, and there's a good chance it'll die if we don't. That is the biggest buck I've seen in Way of the Hunter up until now huge mule deer buck wow <laughs> okay and we've got him right out right out in the open broadside couldn't be a better situation what is this uh, we've also got a two-star adult coming in and you better not block my lane you better keep moving i think i will yeah i think i won't shoot any of the two-star adults i think i'll let those go and see how big they can get but basically, you basically want to shoot anything that's mature because it could die at any point, right? I don't know what he's doing that for. Oh, I got a bad wind, you guys. I didn't even notice. Okay, we'll stay on him. But I am going to have to shift left. I wonder if it was the wind. It was probably the wind. It's, uh, yeah, it's a pretty heavy wind, too. Seven miles. That's okay. We'll get back on him. Oh, he's going this way now. What's he doing? Stop, 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 stop. Perfect. Terrible wind, though. I gotta get out of this wind. I gotta get out of the wind. How am I gonna do it? I think I should go right. Oh, no. They're taking off. No! It's okay. We'll have to reset the time and get them to come back. I don't know why they're leaving. Probably the bad wind. It might be a five-star now. I mean, he could be, yeah. There's a chance. He could be. I might have messed up my chance there. This is going to be like trying to find a needle in a haystack without tracks. I just don't know if... I don't know if we'll be that lucky. We're going to try. I have no idea where they would have gone from here. That's what's, That's our issue right now. We got a four-star mature male. He's huge. And we want to get him before he dies. We know where his drink zone is, but the drink zone that we found him at, he, they only drink there rarely. So doing a time reset is very risky. Because there's a good chance he won't be there anyway. But we did find a feed zone right next to the drink zone. 
and it, and it, uh, it says that mule deer drink there often. We don't know if that herd actually uses this feed zone, but it's really close by and you would think that they would. Okay, here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna set the time for five. We're gonna hope they're feeding there and then we're gonna hope that if they're not feeding there, they come in to drink at that drink zone at nine. And we're gonna hope that that mule deer does not die by tomorrow. I think that's our best bet. Or we try to find it first. We got daylight. We could try to track it first and then do that. Mule deer. Mule deer ahead. 250 meters that way. <sighs> Hang on. Hang on a second. Just hang on just a gosh darn second. 250? Okay, that's gonna be way farther than that. I think we just found where they're gonna be. I think we just found where they're gonna be. That's what I think. That's what I think. Eventually, a young deer will turn into an adult one, and an adult one will turn into a mature one. And if their genetics are good, they might get significantly bigger. If the genetics are bad, they might not get significantly bigger. Um, but we've got a four-star mature, so we know that this has... This is a good genetic buck, right? Fantastic genetic. It made it all the way up to four stars and it's mature. So it might become a five star or it might die first. We're hoping it's going to become a five star and we're hoping it hasn't died yet. Oh boy. <gasps> there he is. There he is. He's looking really old now. He's there and he's basically broadside. <sighs> he's looking very old. He could be a five star. I mean, he could die any minute. We, oh my gosh. <laughs> the, uh, the added layer of suspense that adds, like not knowing if the thing's gonna die is just crazy, as if it's not suspenseful enough. Can you imagine he just dies right in front of you as you're like, as you're getting ready to take a shot. Let's go, let's go perfectly straight here. Okay, he's a little bit to the left. Wow. What a giant. Wow. Wind is perfect. Wind is perfect. I'm so glad we tried to track before resetting the time. He probably wouldn't have lived until tomorrow, I don't think. I don't see them yet, but they're right over there. Check this out. Look. No. They left. No way. There's no way they spooked. I'm prone with perfect wind. Where do they go? Oh, I hear them up here. Okay, they're up here. They spread out. They're right there. I can hear them. Get a little closer. He's probably in there if he's if he's still alive. They're actually inching their way this way, so this will be tricky. And gotta keep in mind, we we spooked him last time prone from not too much closer than this. So I I don't know what we should do. Do we just do we just stay here? I don't have cover this exact spot. I don't want to shoot the wrong one. There's two big males here. right past me. He walked right past me. Tim. He's still four star. Unless that's the other one. There's two big bucks in there. We gotta make sure that's not the smaller of the two. Because that smaller one could be a four now. And he might be a five. How's the wind? We got a good wind. Where did he go? Oh, that's him. Range him. 30. Don't be like that. It's so thick. I don't have a lane. <sighs> Thought 
thought about taking it. Shot felt good. Felt perfect. I aimed just slightly low because he was probably only about, about 130. But I'm not sure what happened. Oh no, do the trees have big hitboxes, Crow? That big? That's rough. Yeah, I, I don't see any blood. I think he spooked that way, right? Or he went that way anyway? So we could check the feed time first. And then it'll go into drink time and then rest time. I think that's our only hope at this point. Four star mature, so that might be him. But we've got another big buck in this herd. Two star adult. Was that the other one? No, he was bigger than a two star. He had double forks. He must have been bigger than a two star. Or maybe not. Maybe that was him. Maybe that was him. He looked, he looked bigger than a two star, though, from what I've seen. Might just be the same deer. He's looking big now. <laughs> now he's looking big. 77 but he is he's on to me already so 150 is as far as I'll go just wanted to stay broadside stay there stay there stop moving 160 just a little closer just a little bit closer with that that's a good shot that'll do it that's gonna do it oh ho, 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 ho. that's a big buck that's a big boy buck there's the blood that looks like good blood to me looks pink Oh yeah, that's good blood. That's the blood we want right there. Medium, air bubbles, definitely lung. I think we got our guy. I think we got our guy. We actually were able to get him after all that. <laughs> Let's go. Where is he? There he is. There's our monster buck. Wow. Sheesh, dude. <laughs> Pick him up. Perfectly centered the lungs there. That's what we needed. That's what we needed. Gorgeous buck. Really happy with that. Let's taxi it. Yeah, I don't think we can change the pose, but I love that pose. And look at the mountains behind it in the in the window. Oh, that's stunning. Wow. Wow, that's so nice. 